Hi guys, this is Vishal and welcome to this live video. We had a very interesting session today in the market and let's look at what it did in the market. So we are talking so in the last few days about short term trading, swing trading, BTST, how to do intraday trading. And we also recorded one uh, a webinar on how to select stocks. So make sure you watch that video on mvswing.com. The re replay is available. And the good news is tomorrow's uh, technical talk, Tuesday technical talk, which uh, we generally do at 1 p.m. Uh, and we are going to we are planning to do at uh, 9.15 for market opening. So let's see. So what we are doing is today we are going to do a post market analysis and we will make a situation, a scenario one, scenario two, scenario three for tomorrow. And tomorrow 9.15, I will be there live on Facebook again for Tuesday technical talk and I will guide you uh, and through which scenario is working and accordingly we can take advantage of tomorrow's session. So are you guys ready? And if you think this this video is going to be helpful, make sure you share this video with your friends and with your timeline so that they can also benefit from this video. So let's get going today's market. And uh, the this is again, those who have just joined, uh, this is our video on post market analysis for today's session. And tomorrow's likely session with tomorrow 9.15, I'm going to do live Tuesday technical talk so that you get live update from what, what we can do. So let's get going with the market today. Uh, and that's the chart of uh, right now Bank Nifty. So let's first look at Nifty and see what it is trying to do in the last few trading sessions. Okay, this is Nifty only. So let me just zoom it up. We don't need uh, volume right now. And OK, so uh, there are a couple of lines. Let me get rid of them. Yeah, so we now uh, have this situation where after reaching this mul multi multiple highs, if you see first thing we need to see is support resistance, right? So resistance is here around 11,800. And resistance is around 11,800. That's what we generally call as double top. Now, so that's uh, in the last seven days or six days, it's been trying to cross that, but not managed to close above that. And you can see some bearish candle pattern, which has come up in the last six, seven days. And today, including today's, which is what we call as, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, bearish engulfing pattern. And it's like if you go on this daily chart, there also there we can see there is a, a, a kind of a divergence here between these two points. So that divergence is also active. <coughs> Sorry. Now, now what we see in the uh, other types, uh, other things like price pattern, volume, momentum. So price is showing resistance, bearish candles, bearish candlestick patterns and a kind of a lower top lower bottom situation in the uh, if you go into the minute details of this at the same time if you look at uh, rsi which is about 60 as per our study of rsi if you're following my work on rsi 60 about 60 means bullish and taking support on 60 can be bullish so like it took support at 60 last time and had a great bounce and again it is at 60 and it can bounce again so tomorrow is going to be a crucial day i think because uh, and, and if it breaks 60, that means the divergence gets confirmation and the official target for this divergence is going to be somewhere uh, at this low, which is around uh, 11,300, which means another three, 400 points. Now, let's see what are the uh, things which are in favor of bulls and which are the things in favor of bears. So in daily chart, uh, divergence is in favor of bears, then in candlestick is in favor of bears, and then there is lower top, lower bottom is favor of bears. And in this resistance is in favor of bears. And let's see uh, what is in favor of bulls. So bulls, you have 60 plus RSI. And you bulls, you have a window here. Remember the window, the what we call as the gap here. That window can act as support. And 20 moving average can act as support. So that is going to be the in favor of bulls. And, but still to reach that window and that 20 moving average, there can be another 100 points uh, away from the current market price, which can make it uh, 11,550. So tomorrow morning, if we break today's low, 
the next support is going to be 11,550. And if we break 550, that means the window breaks, moving average breaks, 60 breaks, then we are going to hit the target of 11,330. This is how you do the analysis on a daily basis. Let's say this is scenario, uh, let's say what, like I mentioned in one of my uh, video, is that it's a mind game. And mind game is another mind game which we can think about is chess. Now in chess, how do you play chess is uh, you think about the opponent's move. Like if he plays this, then I'm going to play this. If he plays this, then I'm going to play that. So like that, you are thinking about the opponent's move and then you are going to play your move. In the same way, you have to play the market. It's a mind game. If market does this, then I will do this. If market does that, then I will do that. Or like you have scenario one, scenario two, scenario three, scenario four. And I don't think there can be more than two, three or maximum four scenarios which can happen in a particular day. So if you are prepared for all these four scenarios, then, then you don't have any confusion on the next day when the market goes up or down. Confusion happens or losses happen when you're not prepared for the other scenario or the other situation because you're only thinking one way which is down or up and market goes opposite. You don't know what to do and you get trapped, you get numb, right? And if you think this is uh, turning out to be a great video, make sure you share this video right now with your friends and with your timeline. And also make sure you watch that video on mbswing.com. The replay of that webinar is still available and be part of our money flow program. So let's say now again, so scenario one is tomorrow it goes down and falls at 20 moving average support plus the window which can bring Nifty another 100 points down. And that can happen in the, ideally it should happen in the first half an hour, one hour and then turn up or stay there. So that means window can act as support. The second scenario is that it can straight away go down and break the support, break the window, break 60, break moving average. That means we are looking for aggressive shots and in the coming days to go to this level of 11,300. And the third scenario is that nothing of this sort happens and market opens slightly up or flat and then starts moving up. That means this 60 support, this window support is acting and it can go back to touch the high, which is around 11,800. Now, now your scenario is that if it turns up, what are my buy list? What are the stocks which are looking strong, strong? And if I'm looking at short, then which are the stocks which are looking weak? That that same analysis I did in one of in the webinar replay on how to do scanning and all. So make sure you watch that replay. So these three scenarios are present tomorrow. And tomorrow, 9.15, I'm going to start my Tuesday technical talk live market on Facebook. So make sure you join and make sure you share the link so that let's see what it does. And in the next, uh, maybe we can start at 9.15, 9.20 and it can go on for another 30 minutes. So we can know in the first 15 minutes, in the first half an hour, what the market is doing. And accordingly, we can take uh, action on those stocks uh, and start trading. And this is exactly what we are going to do in our money flow program where we are going to teach you strategies in the night for two weeks and then give you give you support for next 10 days two weeks from morning till evening during live market so that you make money along with our guidance and even we make money so it's going to be a very interesting session so let's tomorrow 9 15 tuesday technical talk live market let's see what it does go through these three scenarios and the same thing you can do about other stocks like if they are at support, resistance, price, pattern, volume, scenario one, scenario two, scenario three, and get going with your market. So, all right. Are you guys ready? Make sure you share this video and I'll see you tomorrow at 9.15 for live market. Good luck. Good trading.